most of us share that side. But not. But uh, as we dress up and, and act nice, we're just going to put out around the country. I understand that uh, your territory covers uh, the area from Natchez to Pittsburgh. And I want to say that Jerry, so I want to let you know that um, you're very special again in life. And I also understand that there is a total of about 250 years of teaching in this room. And that is awesome. But before I, I, I start our journey back and cover the past 45 years, I want to ask you to tell me something about yourself. I know one person in this room, and I've known him all his life. And um, we'll pass him when we start making introductions, James Harden, uh, because I got to know him because his art, who raised him, is one of my best friends. We work together. We both work together in the government. And Leonard um, is an individual who really makes it happen. Intellectually, she's superior. She stands her ground. And she's afraid of nobody, so we have a lot of common um, respect for those individuals who are prepared and who won't back down. So let me just start here with the lady of the king. And what I'd like you to do is tell me your name. I don't want to learn anything about it except these questions. Just like you did to your students. I want to know your name, where you're from, and how long you've been teaching. And when you give me that information, I'm going to make a little note. I used to be able to do it without taking notes. Now that I've passed 60, I have to make a lot of notes. Okay, so we're going to start here. Don't worry about talking fast. Just let me have some time. Keep up. My name is Melody Walker. Uh huh. I grew up in Jesse County, but I live in Brandon now. I've been teaching on that for almost 40 years. Are you still teaching? Yeah, I'm teaching at the Jesse College. Okay. You're safe. I'm Tanisha Jesse. I'm the host of the Washington, D.C. And I've been teaching for 25 years. Do you teach at this city? Yes, I do. Okay. Do you teach at the Jesse University? Oh, okay. So I can't do that. Do you teach at the Jesse University? Mm -hmm. Oh, you teach at the Jesse University? Okay, good. Let's go over. Steve, before we go. He's a Dexter High School, I've been out 20 years. Who is Dexter? He's a college man. Okay. Illinois. Okay, that's the square problem. It's a big, good company. And you two teachers? Yes, ma'am. My name is Linda Hall. I teach at Wilson County High School in Woodville, Mississippi. How long? 10 years. Okay. Yes, sir. Come here, sir. My name is Holmes and I, and I teach at Curtis Middle School, and I've been teaching for 9 years. Okay. I'm uh, Linda Richard. I teach at North Point High School in the Summit, and I've been teaching 12 years. Mm -hmm. My name is Jerry White Cotton, and I teach at Oak Grove High School in High Serve, Mississippi, and I've been there 19 years. Okay. My name is Shane Lee. I teach at Oak Grove High School also, but this is my second year. Okay, so you all used to fail. The second year. I'm Tracy Whitman. I'm from Columbia, uh, and I teach at Columbia High School. And I've been teaching for 13 years. Okay. Ron and I, Columbia High School, 11 years. I'll need to give a plan. Okay. Marsha McNeil, East Marion High School in Columbia. I've been teaching for 15 years. Okay. Bridget Gilmore from Brookhaven. I've been teaching for 12 years. Okay. Bridget Gilmore from Brookhaven, Mississippi. And I teach at Brookhaven Elementary School. And I've been teaching for 9 years. Okay. Chris Russell, I'm a I get your last name. Russell. Okay. Uh, Hattiesburg, uh, Oak Grove High School in Hattiesburg, and Baggers. Okay. Uh, Jim Barrett, shout out to Madison Kelly. Uh, teach at Hattiesburg High, this is my third year. Okay. Sam Trumbull from Natchez, Mississippi. I teach at Morgan Town Middle School for four years. Okay. Good morning. My name is Benita Hamilton, and I'm from Natchez, Mississippi. I've been teaching at the Natchez School System for 23 years. 23 years. <laughs> Hi, I'm Yolanda Winding. I teach in Natchez at Fraser Elementary and I've been teaching for 22 years. What was your last name? Winding. Okay. Yes, I'm, I'm Frank Kalush. Um, I teach at Macomb High School and I've been teaching for 17 years total. Okay. Vicki Malone, I also teach at Macomb High School, nine years. Alan Lee, Macomb High School. 
school two years. Okay. Give us that some self podcasting first year. First year. Good at Okay. Yes, sir. Um, Barry Jones, Village High School in Home, Mississippi, Twitter. Okay. Now, anybody else who's called the Bones? Or the Bones? Okay, okay. We got a good one. Okay, who's called the Bones? Oh, who's next?
soon be in. But from the time I met him, he was assassinated. His words. That incident then changed my life. He had convinced me in the short time that I knew him one on one that it was important. If you were talking about changing the landscape, scale of Mississippi, of America, it was important that all citizens enjoy the right and privilege of voting. And I really got into that. My father was, was an American government teacher, and he was a math teacher. He was a coach. He did a bit of everything. And he had instilled that in my five sisters and me as well that you must have some say over the systems that go with you. And even though it was against the law at that time, my father taught his Mississippi history class in seventh grade, his American government class, United States history class, and world history class, that voting was essential. So you have young people who learned then about voting and whose parents would probably still pay poll taxes. All my guests now, it's been on my guest for at least 40 years, is my father's poll tax receipt. That coupled with a coin from my mother that she wrote and sent to me in 19, October of 1968. Those keep you focused on what the real deal is. So America hit it right on the head. And I can see myself walking and marching and living there. Because he was right. And it was something about him. So this is almost like when I'm you know, when Obama gets young people stirred up, I'm not knocking and I'm not talking about any political thing, you know, but I do. You know why. But it, it really, it just makes you want to get up and change. And that's the way uh, America affected me. So his death was a blow that still remains in my heart. And the fact that the governmental entities permitted it to happen. And that's not to say that the governmental entities uh, gave by the back the government, but the atmosphere. When you get your leaders to talk about keeping black people in their place, the, the ladies, now I'm saying that some of you, most of you don't remember that, but I see a couple of faces in me that probably remember some of them. And it was nothing to get on the phone on the, on the, on the, on the telephone, on television, and they talk about killing people who came uh, to Mississippi to change our way of life. That was, that was, that was, uh, that was common. So out there, uh, I developed a the agenda. Uh, I changed my pre, my um, major to pre-law at the South Dakota attorney. Most people said, well, you, you love the practice of law, I hate it. Most people <laughs> say, you hate it. I never liked it. I only became an attorney to bring about changes. And back then, everybody was going to, if you really wanted to make a change, you weren't going out being a missionary. You weren't going out saving lives. You were going out charging the system. The system that perpetuated a system that is wrong. So it gave me energy in the morning to get up and get out of law school. That was, you know, I don't want to just tell you the things that happened in law school because they, 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 they can be discouraged. <laughs> uh, unless you were intent on getting out of law school. I was intent on getting out of law school. Now, I'm not going to tell you I'm getting out of law school by saying, yeah, I said, that with nothing that was funny. I, I'm not getting out of the person. But I was determined to learn what other boys would learn that I would intend to practice law. 
Here it is. And I'm here. 